Finally tonight, there's a brand new family film out on Netflix. It's called Blue Miracle. It's the true story of the Casa Hogar, an orphanage in Mexico, where its caretaker enters a fishing tournament as his last hope to keep from losing the orphanage. Through hope and perseverance and faith, they earn a miracle. Recently, I spoke to two of the film's stars, Jimmy Gonzalez and Hollywood legend Dennis Quaid. Take a look. Dennis, Jimmy, great to see you both. Thank hey, you for having me or, or for coming here. Uh, the, yeah, the movie yeah, is really you. all about fatherhood. And Dennis, yeah. your character, Captain Wade, he's estranged from his son. He has to win this tournament, which is at the center of the story. What do we need to know about fathers and sons today? And what of the film story attracted you? Well, this is a story that is a true story. And if it had been a piece of fiction, there's no way I would have done it because it was too unbelievable right. to, to be true, but it, yeah. but it is. And, you know, he's a, uh, my, my character, Captain Wade, at the beginning, he's, he's really is for fatherhood and all this other stuff. He's doing everything for the wrong reasons, basically. Mm -hmm. It's all based on his own ego. And uh, he, uh, he gets humbled these orphans and in, in, that he has to take on, you know, in order to enter this fishing tournament, they wound up, they wind up teaching him a thing or two. And he's humbled by that. And it, you know, that's what God's miracles start to work is when one has humility and gets out of the way. Mm -hmm. Jimmy, you, you initially didn't audition for the role of, of Omar, um, who, who runs the orphanage at the center of this story. What drew you to this tale? And how did your own upbringing help inform your preparation for this role and the relationship between you and these children? My story is very close to, to this story. Mm -hmm. um, and, and I don't think the director knew that uh, before, you know, even after he met me. Um, he didn't know that part of my life till, till after I was cast, but it was just, you know, synchronicity. Yeah. D Dennis, you seem attracted to these inspiring redemptive projects. I mean, The Rookie, A Dog's Purpose, uh, Soul Surfer. I mean, I can keep going all the way back. Uh, what attracts you to these redemptive tales? Well, there's enough Debbie Downer stories in this world. <laughs> <laughs> I you agree. Know, you know, they had their place as well. But, you know, that's... Uh, yeah, I just... Movies for me are... To inspire, I think people go to the movies to begin with to feel things, not to see things mm -hmm. or to hear facts or whatever. They want to feel, uh, you know, what sometimes what they're not getting in life or have or have hope that you know they those th kind of things can happen in their life or they yeah. have happened in their life and they remember uh, those things. Mm -hmm. And uh, like I say, this this story is just. Uh, uh, it's such a wonderful, beautiful miracle. It's a miracle story. Yeah. I, I want to talk about faith and prayer before I run out of time. They both figure prominently in this, in this film. You want to know what helps me when I'm having a hard time? A nail? This isn't just a nail. This is a miracle nail. Do you want to know how it works? Mm, okay. Okay, so when I'm struggling with something, no, I just, I, I write it down on a piece of paper, okay? And then I just take this nail and I hammer it up against the door and pow, God hears me every time. Jimmy, tell us about the nail and then both of you on the importance of prayer in your own lives as well as in this project. Yeah, the nail was, uh, you know, it's, it's a uh, representation right, of, of something else, something mm -hmm. out there, right, that, that keeps reminding you. And um, I thought that was just such a beautiful story uh, uh, trope, if you will. Dennis, what, what form and, and place does prayer have in your life and how did it figure in this story? Well, prayer is the way, you know, to me, it's just basically talking to God. And it's, you know, God gets lonely too, you know, he wants us to talk to him. And uh, it's, you know, like with the nail, it's, it's a way of manifesting from the inside to the outside, what it is that you need or think you need. 
and what you can take out to remind yourself. But uh, it's important, I think, every day to uh, get in touch with God and mm -hmm. in your life, have him in your life. Mm. Well, I thank you both. The movie was beautiful. Our family watched it the other night together and they just loved it. So thank you. Oh, thank you. It was a real gift. All right, Raymond. Thank you, guys. Bye-bye. Blue Miracle starring Dennis Quaid and Jimmy Gonzalez is available on Netflix starting Thursday, May 27th. Thank you.